was about my rhyme. Thank you so much for tuning in. So it has been several months, more like one to two months, and these guppies fries are really growing amazingly. They are just expanding and getting colors in their fins and tails. And as you guys can see, this this guppies looks really really healthy it's amazing how much they have grown again this is my very first time in the in my whole fucking life that I have raised guppy fries and I'm not probably successful but we'll see how it goes uh, I am very much successful till now, but no one knows about the future, so I'm still counting. As you guys can see, this looks really, really amazing and really crispy. <laughs> and by that, I don't, <laughs> I never intend to intend to eat them or anything, but they look really good. These fries are running everywhere. These are just very healthy. And I really think that uh, all the credit goes to uh, the organic foods I have been giving them. Uh, if you have seen my previous videos, uh, or maybe only you have seen only one of my videos because. I have not really uh, published them I have certainly uploaded two of them to other videos but uh, those were supposed to be uh, the updates but I definitely uploaded them but I couldn't publish them because I couldn't find enough time to get back to it but now I think I will uh, publish them but after this this video so it's, it's gonna be <laughs> it's gonna be a little bit late but we certainly will see uh, block two three or four maybe uh, this this piece is about this video is supposed to be vlog number five but the thing is I couldn't publish the other ones uh, I couldn't make them public just because I couldn't find uh, that much time because I have been really really busy with my with some of my other projects uh, so yeah let's see what it goes You know, it fascinates me how much these these guys have grown, and uh, I never got to tell you, but the mother, uh, the mother uh, of which these fries are, she gave birth to total three batches, three batches. I mean, like she she has given birth three times. The first time she gave birth, uh, it was like six babies. But after that, she gave like twelve more, and the last time she she gave like seventeen of them. Seventeen. This was crazy, and you're gonna be disappointed a little bit now, but. But let me assure you there's there was nothing I could do uh, so the first time she gave birth uh, it was like 
six babies and then then I then after she gave birth another time I could save only uh, only five more of them from the next birth and I total have uh, 10 to 11 babies now and the last time I couldn't save any one of them because The moment she gave birth the last time, it was only a brief introduction to them, to, from them to me, because uh, I just saw it at the last hour when I was about to sleep, and I just thought that maybe I would change the water or maybe separate them uh, in the next morning. But uh, when I when I got to bed and when I woke up the next morning. I saw none of them. The whole batch was oh, the wind flowing. <laughs> there are a ton of winds here. Anyway, so the whole batch, the whole, uh, all the babies were eaten by its own mother, by their own mother, and that was certainly heartbreaking for me. But. There was nothing I could do. I was feeling so exhausted. I worked out and I just got back from outside. I had some work to do and I was so tired. I, I thought maybe, maybe I would separate them the next morning, but that was a great, huge mistake. So, uh, but I could save one though uh, from that, but that didn't last very long. That's the bad news. Uh, that uh, that lived for about like four to five days more uh, and I included that uh, uh, I mix them all together and that guy just that guy was really really weak and everyone used to bully that that one and that was a bit frustrating but so uh, I, I separated that and I mix them again I, and I just did that on and off on and off <clears throat> I'm sorry so it was it was not a good idea to mix uh, mix big babies with uh, uh, little ones so don't do that ever again and the mistake I, I just want you guys to learn from my mistakes okay so the, another thing was I could have done one thing I could have just separated the mother mother first uh, and keep it in another bowl or aquarium or something uh, in that way the babies would have survived and I would have gotten a, a bit more guppies but eventually uh, they don't last very long because they just um, some of the babies are naturally healthy and some of them are not very healthy so this happens this happens a lot i think i have talked to some other peoples and uh, they have given me the same answer that it often happens that mother eats their own babies and not all babies last so don't worry about that try to save as much as you can so that's it guys uh, thank you so much for watching this video and please give it a thumbs up if you like it please hit that like button if you uh, really appreciate and please subscribe that means a lot thank you